All right, where's Christina? Hey, Steve. <laughs> Hey, Steve, so I'm in a real life Devil Wears Prada situation. My boss is very challenging and she's kind of condescending to me. And she even accused me of doing things that I didn't do. Mm -hmm. So my question is, I like to be a professional and do things with integrity, but I'm tempted to leave this job because of this boss, but I really need the money. I don't know what to do. You want to leave the job? Yes. But what you... You got another job? Not yet, but oh, it's that well, hey, well, where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> now, hold up. I got what you're saying. She might be uh, condescending, but I can't mess my money up because you condescending. You know what you ought to do? This is how you do it. I, you got to pick a date. 90 days, 120 days. 60 days, whatever it is, pick a date that you're gonna walk off from this job. You got that much time to prepare another position. People like when you, uh, when you uh, interview for positions and you already have one. That says a lot. Here's a person who's trying to come up and improve themselves. Employers like it when you apply for jobs and you already have one. They know this ain't an act of desperation. This person's really trying to elevate themselves. So pick a date like how long would you, would you think it would take for you to get another job? I'd say between 15 to 30 days. 15 to 30? Yeah, I'm on it. I'm already on it. <laughs> oh, okay, so pick, pick 30 days away. That's the date that you're gonna walk out. Once you have a date where you know this is going to end, you're able to deal with it a lot better because you see the end coming. That's what I always do. Oh, yeah. Once I see that this ain't no real happiness for me, I gets me a date. So you get you a date, let's say 30 days from now. So then every time she's talking to you, condescending, giving you bad information, accusing you of things you didn't do, you just go, 13 more days. <laughs> Excuse me? Did I, st did I steal the stationery? <laughs> no, I ain't stole no stationery. <laughs> 10 more days. <laughs> See, once you know, that's the thing about pain and misery. If you always knew the date that pain and misery would end, you could cope with it better. I take everything going on wrong with me, I hand it to the Lord. I just hand it to him. Ain't my problem no more. Ain't my problem no more. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're gonna enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.